arrest warrant for the main aggressor in the Sequela Robinson crime. Without holding you any further, let's get right into it. An arrest warrant has been issued in the death of Shanquella Robinson, a Charlotte woman, K-I-L-L-E-D, while on vacation in Mexico. According to a Mexican prosecutor and confirmed by ABC News, Daniel De La Rosa Anaya, a prosecutor for the state of Baja California, sir, told ABC a friend of Robinson's, who is the direct aggressor, is being sought by international authorities on charges of femicide. Quote from the prosecutor, this case is fully clarified. We even have a court order. There is an arrest warrant issued for the crime of femicide to the detriment of the victim and against an alleged perpetrator, a friend of her who is the direct aggressor, De La Rosa Anaya told ABC News. Actually, it wasn't a quarrel, but instead a direct aggression. In my opinion, what I believe the prosecutor is saying is that it wasn't a quarrel, it was direct aggression. A quarrel could just come out of nowhere. Direct aggression is with intent, meaning direct, meaning on purpose. Finish quote from the prosecutor. We are carrying out all the pertinent procedures such as the Interpol alert and the request for extradition to the United States of America. It's about two Americans, the victim and the culprit. Sidestep, I got really confused because this is not about two people, it's about seven. The victim who was Shanquala Robinson and the Cabo Six. But from what I'm gathering, this is just the start. So they will pull the main person, which is the culprit who took her life and they will go from there. So for the other Cabo Five, it is not over for you. This is just the beginning. Authorities have not identified who they are working to arrest at this time. Side note, so a lot of people are stating that it's Dejanae Jackson, but it could definitely be Winter Donovan. It could be either one of these two. And then I even thought maybe Khalil, but I think they're going to go off of who actually did it to her. And that's between Dejanae Jackson and Winter Donovan. So one of these women are definitely getting arrested and the FBI will be capturing one of them soon and extraditing them to Mexico. Again, y'all, this is just the beginning. Michael Lettieri, an expert on femicide in Mexico, said when a woman is K-I-L-L-E-D in the country, authorities are often required to open an investigation as a femicide. From there, they look into whether she was K-I-L-L-E-D for reasons due to her gender or if there were specific circumstances such as DV. ABC News told Robinson's mom on Wednesday evening that an arrest warrant had been issued in the case. Salamandra's quote, I feel so good. That's a good feeling, Salamandra Robinson said. That's what we've been waiting for, for someone to finally be held accountable and arrested. I just can't wait for justice to be served. Her parents said Robinson 25 left Cabo San Lucas with several friends on October 28th. A day later, she had passed away. As of now, we do not know who the warrant is for, and I think that's good news. Why? It's because they're already running, they're already in hiding. So if they don't know who the warrant is for, it will be a little easier, I feel, for the FBI and the bounty hunters that are looking for them to be able to pick them up and get them to where they need to be without any issues. If they say exactly who it is, then of course they're going to hide. They're gonna do everything in their power to make sure that they're not seen because they're already doing it. So again, we don't need to know that right now. All that matters is that an arrest warrant has been issued and Mexico is doing everything in their power to pick up the ball that they dropped in the first place. I love you all. I will be live with an update on this. Thank you so much.